guys, we got new footage from Roswell. So guys, let's get real and spaced out. Strap yourself into your rocket because we're blasting off here into the cosmic universe in IO2. So in the last video, Sandra asked you guys who is the best fighter. But in this video, I just want your personal opinion. Do you believe in aliens? And you know what? If you've seen one or anything like that, let me know down there. So do you guys remember Roswell, New Mexico in 1947? So there is new photos of the Roswell incident that are going to be shown to the public. It's being called the Roswell Slides and they're going to be shown at a national auditorium in New Mexico. Suiting considering Roswell happened in New Mexico. Now these photos were shot on Kodachrome which is a very old school type of film. And apparently shows that these aliens were real, man. Obviously people are saying they're fake. I mean, the photos that you're seeing now, they've proven to be faked. However, you got some people from the CIA and other professionals who are saying that this actually happened when they looked at these photos. But you know what, guys? I guess we won't really know till the actual event. But you know what, guys? I want to jump into a new theory. It's going to be like jumping into a black hole. We're going to talk about the universe, baby. By the way, that was my Matthew McConaughey. Scientists have been pondering over a new theory. That is whether or not the universe could be a hologram. Basically, the holographic principle is the idea that a universe with gravity can be described by quantum field theory in fewer dimensions. Now, this has been used as a mathematical tool in strange curved places, but they're starting to believe that this could happen to flat spaces as well. So our own universe could actually be two-dimensional instead of what it appears to be three-dimensional. To dumb it down, the universe to us feels like it's vast and all around us. But the truth is, the universe may not actually be going around, but it might actually be straight. And this is because our position in the universe, we are so small that our optical illusion is making us see it as something completely different. Now considering we talked about Roswell and all that jazz, let's talk about alien life and whether or not they think they might actually find it. Alan Stofan, who is a NASA chief scientist, stated that by the year 2025, humanity may have first contact with an alien for the public. Now this is because over years and years of studying the universe, NASA has now whoop, narrowed its search to where to look for life. Now that means life could be in our solar system, outside of our solar system, and you you know what, who knows, they may just find a bug or something. But for example, they're looking at the moons like Europa that have water underneath its icy surface. That means there could be a whale under there, son. Anyways guys, that's it for here at IO2. We try to theme things together with a little bit of space stuff. But if you guys got a story, be sure to write to us. Also, if you like all our other videos, you know, check them out, you know, do that kind of thing. Do that YouTube, like, subscribe, you know, all that mumbo jumbo. All right, see you later guys, and uh, keep it real.